Hello guys and welcome to yet another exciting Python tutorial so uh, before we go ahead and view the video I wanted to show you my blog it's ghostg one programmingblogspotcom so I'll leave the link down below if you're interested in the scripts maybe copy and paste it and just try it yourself so uh, we will go ahead and view the video okay hello and welcome guys to the second part of the click bot so uh, let's start up from where we left so we completed the this program uh, the uh, button clicker so now we need to see the uh, second part which has the real click but so let's see add an existing file no 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 create a file yeah okay let's create a file let's see uh, let's say this one and we just do two okay now we have the second okay so in this uh, in this click part we're not importing tkinter we're importing another module which is C type so let's just import it and we talk about it so C type let's uh, C types actually uh, let's you use the control the mouse and the keyboard so today we're controlling only the mouse so let's try it so let's define another function or better yet at first off we're gonna use C types and then dot so now uh, we're gonna call the uh, win DLL and then dot user and then oh uh, yeah user 32 and then dot okay set cursor and position is pause so now basically basically what we have is the X position and the Y position so uh, as you can remember we did in in our window we did uh, 400 x 300 so uh, let's do this one 200 so it will be between and let's just do this one also 200 so now it will take my mouse to the 200 200 position let's try did you see that let's try it so look at my mouse it's in here now it's in the position 200 200 So, so now what do we need to do is to click with the mouse. So we hit enter, and then we use the same style of the uh, command: win dll c types. Sorry for that typo. Let's win dll and then dot user thirty two dot. Now we do a uh, mouse event. Okay, mouse underscore event. So we have we have zero 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 and zero so we got five zeros the first zero let's change it to let's use hashtag this is mouse yeah left mouse left left mouse this one is down guys so we need to put another one which is up so C tabs dot win the other dot user thirty two dot mouse underscore event and we use the four button to make the mouse uh, click up or uh, similar to letting up the click clicking down and clicking up so this one is left also mouse up so that means it clicks and it lets go let's try it it clicked and it let go so let's select this line so it will click at this line okay let's let's go in the okay this one we are selecting this so let's try it Save. as you can see it clicked this one so we have the same uh, the, the same uh, parameters 
that we did too many lines in here but it clicked on this one similarly to a human click so now what do we need to do is to put this one in a function and call it okay so let's hit enter let's define click wait sorry click um, button click B is click button this one has no parameters because we did the uh, position we, we already signed the position so let's indent this thing and let's do another thing let's just uh, use uh, yeah let's call the, the function click B and like this so when we run it it's clicked in here so <coughs> let's put this click B in a for loop so for 12 it will click 12 times uh, for X sorry guys for X in range of 12 you click 12 times in position in the position of 200 200 okay so we need to run this program and execute this program okay let's let's run this program okay one of the downflow oh yeah I, I shouldn't uh, I shouldn't move that one because the position is already set so one of the downflows with wing IDE that's you cannot run two programs parallel so you need to run one program and then after it you need to run the other so uh, I found a way to get over that so one of them is to just do it in the Python shell and the other is to run it like the usual so I should run the usual like this and the other one I'm gonna use I'm gonna move this one in here and then I'm gonna go to the options after I click into the Python shell tab oh my god okay oh my god I did it again sorry guys okay now I go to options and evaluate click bot part 2 that's great now let's see how many clicks I'll get okay instantly I got 12 clicks so as I told you before it will loop 12 times in here so let's try 100 that's good okay uh, let's not stop the program I nearly did some big mistakes so let's evaluate another time now boom if I go to the debug IO I'll find doubt that I have clicked 100 times and this 112 this, this 12 is because of the older program I didn't restart the program I let it continue executing so uh, this is that's it for this part and the uh, in the uh, next part we will see uh, this click bot with a timer so how many clicks per minute so uh, until then stay safe well that's it guys for this uh, video for today click the like button if you like the video and click on the subscribe button if you are not subscribed yet and do not forget to hit the bell button to get notified if I upload any videos in the future and you can see on the right there is my latest video click on it if you haven't watched it yet well that's it guys for this uh, video for today click the like button if you like the video and click on the subscribe button if you are not subscribed yet and do not forget to hit the bell button to get notified if I upload any videos in the future and you can see on the right there is my latest video click on it if you haven't watched it yet